before Starscream took it. Meaning? Detonation imminent. Can it be repaired? Accessing Teletran Alpha. The Proustar's plasma core was forged in the plasma energy chambers on Cybertron. Only that plasma energy interface on Cybertron can it be repaired. Starscream, you must bring it to the tower immediately. The core is unstable. Unstable? Oh, you don't say. Starscream is taking the plasma core back to the city. We have no time to waste. We have time to waste. All right, where is it? Come on. Got it. Here we go. Uh, there's some other stuff around here, such as this. And I think there's one of there's like a mission or two around here somewhere. Oh, is this? What could this be? A mystery object. A litter. Oh. Huh. There's this over here. I feel like there's a mission around here. Could be misremembering. That's it. Nice. Also nice. I mean, you can see some, uh. You can see the corners out to cut, but still, besides the point. Oh, there we go. You seize it. Because I seize it. The Elite Seeker. So, nothing drastically different. I've got this six sword. I've got Devastator's Drills. I did get a new sniper rifle. I just did, um, challenge number two. Managed to get a double S. That's pretty cool. But other than that, nothing out of the ordinary. We have all the abilities from last episode. Um, this sword just rocks. Big time. And does a whole lot of damage. Yeah, Bumblebee feels like his focus lasts a lot longer than Grimlock's, innately. Don't believe I have any focus buffs. And yep, good sure you. Alright. Ooh, good dodge. I dodge better though. I dodge better. Alright, there's that one thing to shoot. I'm pretty sure there's something over on this side of the island too, so... Let's see... Hmm. Maybe it's better to be up here. So let's see. Oh, hitting something. Oh, thank you, FromSoft. <laughs> That's what it feels like. It feels like trying to shoot a bow through that tight, like the very tight spaces. Out of the way, you. If you know, if you didn't know, my sniper was powerful. Well, neither. So we can't go back now, great. Well played, mate. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Yeah, it's crimsy. Oh. All the way down there. That's lame. Oh well. Time to bust some deceptive chops. Yes, that sounded lame on purpose, I swear. I was not trying to make that sound cool, I promise. Oh, here comes me, boy. Here comes me dodging needlessly. And here comes me comboing the hell out of him. I kind of intentionally dropped that second vehicle attack. I wanted to go for some heavies. That's what I was after. Bingo. No, I want to lock into you, Seeker Chan. Kind of get them good so we can launch into them. Almost. There we 
Yep. Again, like, this game's probably not... Well, like, probably doesn't have the same depth as a lot of other Platinum titles. Now, that's probably why I enjoy Astral Chain, too. It's not as deep with a combo, um... depth, I guess. As, say, like, Bayo. Well, maybe even Wonderful 101. People did say there are a lot of comparisons between um, Astral Chain and Wonderful 101, so I do, well, wonder <laughs> if I'd like it more now I've played a lot of this in Astral Chain. And also, I should draw attention to the fact we are on Mission 2 right now. So, you know, that kind of, you know, lends credence to the idea that I have totally been playing. Is he gone? He went splash. Oh. Get out of here, you. You're one of the cane boys, ain't you? Damn, I think that's long as I've gone without a cage reference of late. I only took up to like, what, part four? Oh. That's embarrassing. Ow. Man, that was embarrassing. That was very embarrassing for you, Harrow. That makes me feel better about myself. So yeah, there we go. As you can see, I got that vehicle attack which got gave us the slowdown. And we have this to read. The kinetic shields. The barriers are erected by whatever is doing the cyber forming. Blah, 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 um, yeah, extreme force, so a rush attack. That's all you can do. Rush at it. And we're almost at the end of the bridge. What was that? I've seen it. Is there something down there? No, well, that's probably the thing we shot. No. Well. Oh, whatever shall we do? That worked out really well for you. Oh boy. Good combo, good combo. So this proves they're actually, you know, if we've made it this far, they're like, oh, you, you can take it. You can take two at once. They're honestly not that hard to fight. I'd rather fight them than the Elite Seekers, to be honest. Not that they're much harder in the first place. Ooh, that was lucky. Alright. That's why I love that attack so much. Oh, more of them, huh? I mean, is a rush attack the equivalent of a running R1 with a katana? Perhaps. I don't know. I'm the wrong person to ask. I don't use katanas typically in Souls games, so... Man, I remember, I'm pretty sure in the Bloodborne playthrough, I just went, Ah, oh, so this is the, uh, this is the Chikage. Probably not using it. You know. Yeah. You know, it is what it is. Alright, maybe maybe we can go back. Haven't hit a loading screen, so we probably can. Very generous jump in car form. In car form. M no men. Well done, mate. And yeah, let's just see. Up oh, there's the mission. I don't know how we missed it. Maybe it, it must load in after we fight the first seeker. And my problem was I got too close. Hey, come on, you shit. I mean, you adorable little... Um... You... Quite a creme Zeke. This is as far as we can go. To low poly city. Ah oh well, you know. Platinum know, you know, they understand where the budget needs to go. I mean, it's not as bad as when you look to the, uh, go to the right side of High Wall of Lothric and look out at the rest of the castle, uh, rest of the High Wall. That gets real ugly very fast. Oh wait, no, so mission one was the Seekers. I was, compl I'm completely full shit. I have to heal this way. I'm scrubbing this up big time. So yeah, they get some um 
they get some... Oh, well, I was trying to do my L1 dodge. You have to heal. Wow, I'm, I'm doing well. Um, they, they're getting their money's worth out of this, that's for sure. It's what makes me wonder if, like, they saw these budget games as not only as a means of, like, you know, staying alive as a company, but also as a good way to test um, different gimmicks and all that they'd apply to bigger projects. Because that's kind of how it feels. Um, don't know how, like, Korra's style swapping works, uh, works in with other games. I can't think of a good analogy because I'm not very familiar with it. Mostly because I never played it. The most I ever watched was, um, the most I ever saw was Wooly and Liam's playthrough. And even then, like, that was, like, normal difficulty, I think, so. I mean, I'd like to have a crack at it if I could, but, well, can't buy it legally, so. Oh, well, I guess that means there are no alternatives to playing it. Yep. Definitely no other ways I could go about um, trying that game. Okay, you know what? I think there's a secret mission this way now. Let's just check. Um, what was it? In one of the guns I have... Oh, yep, there we go. It's spawned now. You all seen it. I was over here. There were destroyed trees on the way. That means totally the case. Oh, yeah, this one's fine. Except for the part where I'm shit at aiming. Ah, oh. oh, crap. It's so slow. How can I possibly hit it? Oh, I forgot there was a second lot. False sense of security there. Alright, we'll give this one more crack and then we'll see uh, if I crack. Okay, this is way easier than the sniper. I, uh, I retract my statement immediately. Uh. Yeah, I'm pretty garbage of this, to be honest. Okay, well, we got some loot. I ain't gonna whinge. That's good enough. I'll, I'll totally do you one day when I feel like subjecting myself to that. Yeah, so like I said um, in the previous part, we will be back here to fight a Megatron later. Hooray. It's gonna be really cool, I swear. Damn it. One more shot, and then I'll, and then I quit. We are falling very slowly. Come on. I'm, I'm missing. I'm in the wrong place to begin with. Yeah, okay, that's it. Ah, oh, Vesuvo. That's what I was thinking of. Man, there's been a ton of stuff to do on this island already. And I'm garbage at two of those things. Radio, leisurely drive across the bridge. That seems way longer during the Blitzwing fight. Um, even though I somehow managed to make it look shorter in my version of the fight. Because I just totally wrecked it. Now, speaking of totally wrecking, if I pull this off, I'm going to juggle Motormaster hard. Because that, that happened last time when I was playing this on Prime. I messed him up big time. Teletran 1, I need coordinates on Starscream. Routing, based on Starscream's last known trajectory. I'm sending probable coordinates now. Last one there is the corroded diode, Autobots! Motormaster, don't let them get there first. Yeah, so Starscream is always proving his worth to the Decepticon cause. Meanwhile, here's Motormaster. Hey, Mona Master. No, come back here. I want to fight you. Yeah, he's going to stop to do the jump. Come on. There we go. 
He's not actually too hard to combo. I've done it before plenty of times. It seems like a regular thing I can get going now. All you gotta do is beat him, but um, that includes, you know, beating the crap out of him too. The only problem is he deals, he deals quite a bit of damage. I totally forgot about that. That's because my attack, my attack speed's way faster in, um, well, you know, on my 360 file. But yeah, um, something like this. You can get him in a bit of a loop. He'll have to come down eventually, so once he's... Maybe once he's on the ground, he'll get he'll get out of his combo. Yeah, he's, um... Yeah, no, he's, he's breaking free, slowly. Okay, we don't appear to have him under the lip anymore, which probably means he has a chance to get out. But, I mean, we've only got to get, like, one more combo in. And that should do it. There's all my goodies. Now he will get back up and we can just do it again. It's pretty funny actually. He dropped some good stuff at least twice. I can't remember if he dropped anything good the third time. But still, it's a pretty reliable way. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> pretty re reliable source of good shit. Hey, hey, where the fuck do you think you're going? Come back here. Yeah, so he doesn't have a health bar anymore because we destroyed him. So what I managed to do on my prime fire was launch him into the buildings. We'll see if we can get him down there. I don't think we will be. Um, and I just curb stomped him. I just kept wall bouncing him basically. Anything with good knockback is, a, is particularly effective at this kind of stuff. Not that I have anything with incredibly, incredibly good knockback right now, but... I'm just going to be careful not to hit the Kion Barrier, because that'll probably break it. Oh, well, okay. That works still. It was either not to hit it, or, um, in, in the sense of, like, stunning me, so I couldn't keep attacking. Like that. There we go. A hard mode master, yeah, yeah. And as you can see, our gauge is going hard, too. Wow, he wasn't going to come down for a second. Hit him with the spin. Oh, where do you think you're going? I'm not done with you. <laughs> yeah? That's cute. Come on. No, I think he'd get away. Adorable. And this is why I love Bumblebee so much. Should be one more cycle and he's dead. Well, you know, until he decides to drive off again. Yep, here we go. Beautiful. Neat. Alright, let's go. And we've got a special um, charge for the actual fight. Even though we've already beaten them twice. And um, yeah, he will get up. I'm pretty sure there's enough time for him to try. Won't bother beating him another time. I don't think we get anything except for him for a while. I saw that. I'll come back to you. There's probably a ton of collectible stuff I'm missing by just racing. Ah, well, actually, ah, fuck it. Let's just go. Motor Master, well played. Oh, yeah, he's, he does have some stuff to his credit. If he hits you, yeah, it's gonna hurt. He will be bigger, faster, and stronger too. Um, just not now. That's the phase two of Motor Master crew. I, again, I'm not well versed in Transformers lore, so I'm not exactly sure what um, parts make Minasaur. There we go. Kind of dropped him there, but that would probably work out for the best because I de dealt way more damage. Yep, there we go. Oh, good job of avoiding the heavy. He's got some, he's got some game. So, Motor Master's the boss I feel very confident just matching against. Because Bumblebee is fast enough to just constantly get vehicle attacks out. Which is why I love the fist weapon so much, speaking of which. So, I'm hitting him with heavies, and even then, I'm getting the vehicle attacks, no problem. 
Let's do a let's do a heavy rush while well, I was going to try to, but hey look at that! Vehicle attack, huh? Crazy. Dropped it. Oh well. I'm about to drop him. Even harder. You tried. You tried. That's for damn sure. With the core leaking, I should be able to rig something together to get a directional fix on the plasma energy. Right. Let's go get that plasma core. That's some good stuff. Cool, cool, cool. I think we can track it now. Your sensors should change color if you're pointing in the right direction. Yeah, so this is now this is the method to deter us from going for secret missions. But oh well, it won't. There's a bunch of uh, Decepticons over there. Oh well, into the arc. Let's go. All right, what do we got? Cryo gloves. Ooh, nice burn sword. Ah, freeze. That'll be good. Mm-hmm, bolt machine gun, cool. Um, is that a good sniper I just saw? Red. Alright, let's see how much cash we got. Well, actually, first of all, let's blow a ton on making some tech that I'll totally screw up. We don't have any skills to buy, so that's alright. How's this? Yeah, not really what I had in mind, Will Jack. Damn it. I mean, that's all right. all right. We'll make Got one it. more. Yep, how's that? <sighs> Damn it. All right. No, um, the game's conspiring against me today, I guess. Uh, Cryo Sword. Pretty all right. These B weapons, B rank weapons, pretty good. I like it. Um, that sword's going to be cool. If we get any burn, um, burn ability, so that'll be awesome. I'm definitely going to make that for someone else. I'm probably going to try Sideswipe or something in a bit. I won't swap to him just yet, but I might try him for Mission 5. Alright, well, um, that's all for now. Uh, let's just see real quick. Lab. Alright, um, can't afford a thing. And even then, that's worse than what I got. See, it's the same thing as like the start of Borderlands 2, where it's like, uh, maybe the, uh, maybe the... Machine's got something worth your time, but very quickly you've got something way better. Based on earlier readings of the core's power signature, I mm -hmm. think we can track Let's it head towards him now. But we're gonna oh what's this? In the right direction. The... Plasma accelerator. Okay. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Ooh, the prevalence of the space bridge technology. Interesting. Kind of. Yes. I don't know. Closer you are. Ow! Son of, son of a bitch. Oh, should have upgraded my gun a little. Could have two shot him. So this is the way it wants us to go. Hence all the uh, stuff. Now, while I'm thinking of it, we'll go to the map. So this is where we fought Megatron. Once upon a time. And as you can see, there's lots of stuff. Lots of stuff. So let's go see if we can find some secret missions. Mostly because I think this one's actually going to be quite short. It's, um... It's a Defend Wheeljack mission. Timeless Classics. Um... And then Fight Menasaur. Yeah, spoiler. We, we fight him in his big form. Yeah. Yeah, I got nothing. So we're back here already. More goodies. 
And the wrist have to shoot again, but like, whatever at this point. We don't really need to do that. We have that, however. So we'll get that, and then we'll... Right? <laughs> okay, <laughs> just wasn't, uh, just wasn't expecting it to go that high. Alright. It's just to destroy all crates, yeah? Destroy everything. Got it. Right, so capture the plasma core. Got it. This shouldn't be too hard, because we can just... Now, I believe that's all the Decepticons we actually have to murder. So that's cool. Oh, no, there's more. Oh, there's a flag on top of the building. Got it. No, guys, I want to destroy this. Excuse me. Alright, just let me get this. Is there any more? Nope, it's just fighting. Oh, wait, no, there's one more here. Come on. I can't shoot it while you guys are here. Screw off. Worth it. Again, worth it. Oh great, the cat is up, so we might have some of that classic meowing. A staple of the channel. I beat her with anger though. She's looking at me. She's contemplating it. And starting against it, amazingly. Ooh, still safe. Proving its worth yet again. As it will continue to all the way throughout this playthrough. Especially if I ever go, eh, yeah, we'll, we'll do a Prime difficulty one, because why not? That's a pretty good trick. I'm, I mean, I'm biased, but I like it. Oh, we picked him up already. Rad. Cool, cool, cool. Side missions for days. We are not gonna bubble with you. If we got places to be, gotta follow my rainbow. Follow me, set me free. Something, something, escape from the city. No Decepticons, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Probably when we come out of this, though. So. Yep, yeah, we are really close, actually. Kind of not what I want, to be honest. Yes, meow indeed. All right, let's have a look at the map now to see where we ended up. We are, oh, sorry, we are here. We're up here. We're teleported here. So there's little bits and pieces around. Um, spoiler, the mission, oh, sorry, mission objective is right here, sorry. I'm using the center, center um, little part of the map. But there's no highlight to uh, accentuate what I'm pointing out. Oh, indeed, meow. Yeah. There's a bunch of Seekers, but we can't really... Yeah. Well, I mean, I could fight them, but... We've already done enough time-wasting. There's this again, so... Just excuse me one second. Oh, wow. That's what I was expecting. <laughs> well done, me. Um, got to open the door for the cat, and... Uh, well, just... My, uh, my... What's we do? Now, okay, yeah, that's that spy plane I can't hit. Jerk ass over there. Oh, what, what are you? Alright, we're just gonna drive on past these claws because I don't care at this point. Spoiler, it's right there. Now we won't go in. Let's just have a look what we... we we're not gonna have a look at what we got. We're just gonna do the mission. And that casing is getting bigger. I think I can patch the leak temporarily if I can just get to it. We do not have time. We better make time. Plasma energy is unpredictable. It could explode, cause gravitational rifts, warp a wormhole into existence. Open the case and patch the core. We will hold off any foes. Let's see, will we hit them all? Yes, we will. This is a lot harder than it seems, by the way. Just gonna put it out there for anyone who has not played this game. Um, yeah, this is actually one of the harder parts. 
any of these wheeljack missions. Because as you can see, he is get he is getting turtled right now. And I'm getting turtled too. He does gain a little bit of health back in between um, faces, I think. Yeah, like that. That was one of the harder parts, that's for sure. The Seekers won't be as bad, I think. At least on paper they shouldn't be, but... Knowing my prowess, such as getting hit by that. So, one of them is getting nice and close, so we're gonna get... Yep. We're gonna get in there. Come on. Well, flying a little low, aren't you, boys? Ow. Alright, sorry. I don't think anyone cares. If they do, well, this is not a hardcore playthrough. There is a reason Astral Chain is my favorite Platinum game. Because it's easier than most. Grimlock helping. Grimlock help. Thank you, Grimlock. Could you, huh? Um, I'm in the middle of trying to help you, Jack. Yeah. Grimlock tanking the hit, sir. Thank you, buddy. So this is one of those sequences, uh, sequences where healing friends is actually quite useful. Or the uh, plus healing, because we actually can. If they take enough damage, they'll get down, which means we got to help them up. Right here. Yeah, well this one isn't too bad because you just kind of shoot them like this. Uh oh, I'm out of. Phew, okay. I think it's some big guys, right? So, not actually as bad as you think. Especially when I've got a charge super so we can just do this and chunk them. That's it. Okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. I was gonna say, one hit and Wheeljack is dead, but that doesn't matter when they're dead. Yes, meow, thank you. I mean, I can, I've done it before. Might just take a few hits in the process and need a heal, but I can totally beat you, Mesor. You're not that hard. There is that Vortex attack, though, which I've really got to watch out for, but that's just about it. Oh, um, we've got a capsule, have we? So why not? Let's see. Ah, oh, it's a hard coat. Our power boost would make this go a little faster. Screw it. I mean... It'd be good to use a hard coat just because one's sitting right there, but who cares? We won't need it. Double damage is making this go a lot faster, though. Phase two. I probably chose a good time to make phase two start, though. Because when it comes out of this, the guitar is going to be very heavy. Oh, there he is. I better ask, where in the world is Motor Master? Ooh, good one, good one. Yep. He's going for that, he's going for Devastated Scrab. Okay, the buff is worn off, that's fine though. I want to extend this part a little bit anyway. This won't be the only time we fight him, by the way. Just the only time in this mission. We'll get around two, don't worry. Definitely we'll get around two. Got him. Into the space bridge. 
to Cybertron! Except you, Starscream. You stay here and burden the Autobots with your incompetence! Laugh while you can, Megatron! But I will laugh last! They have gone through the space bridge! After them! I mean, to be fair, Prime, I don't think you know that for certain, but... Yeah, so, um, chapter four. Also very quick, isn't it? 34 minutes. That's crazy. Anyway, what do we got? Menasaur's Ionizer And we have another Hyper Cryo Hammer. Twin Energon Swords? Yeah, Twin Thermal. Okay, we get it. Yeah, so I think I've shown off just about most of the weapon types. Fists, hammers, um, twin swords, single swords. Let's just go through real quick. Um, I'm stopping here because this is perfect. This is a nice self-contained episode. Um, let's just see. Sword, gloves. That's also why I'm stopping. Because of her. Um, yeah, that feels like it. I think I've shown off all the weapon types. So it's not a huge range and, you know, they, all the types have the same combos, but besides the point, it's pretty fun. All right, I'm very happy with this. Um, I'll synthesize and all that stuff later because I have a screaming cat. Return to main menu. Um, just real quick, let's have a look. Oh, well, yeah, we'll check out in one second, but have a look in challenges to see what extra we have unlocked. Alright, cool, we got quite a few now. So I'd unlock this from, from mission to uh, defeat the Decepticons. This arena is a bit of a spoiler, to be honest. That's where you fought Megatron. That's the spoiler arena. That is, um, that's where we fought Megatron the first time. And, you know, of course, Megatron the second time. That's uh, Blitzwing's Island. That's exactly where we just were with Defend Wheeljack. In fact, that is explicitly what you do in that mission. Um, on the bridge. On the highway area. Um, bridge again. And shoot them up. This section's that. These little ones are pretty fun and pretty easy, so, you know. I'm not going to complain. Anyway, that's enough out of me. Yes, that's enough out of you, too. Alright. One bubble going in, into collection for this. Ready up. See for chapter 5, which will be To Cybertron. Megatron's escape to Cybertron with the plasma core. The Autobots follow. <laughs>